Hello everyone, here is two insane gold trains at the East Green Baby Gold Station. And let me tell you, the baby line was really insane during this day. And our fees were taken on Saturday, August 24th. Alright, let's get into them. So the two gold trains that I caught was heading north from Trotter to Berry. So the first train I caught is Gold 6915. It was led by old cab car 251 with a really powerful horn. And let me tell you, I love that. And pushing it is 626. And that has 10 passenger cars. And I was there alone when I filmed this because Jack Logan W was also there with me. That evening, when the sun went down, I got word that we had something more insane on the Berry Line. It was so insane that John L57 and I decided to see it, even though it was running 15 minutes late. It was originally supposed to come at 9.59, but instead, it showed up at 10.14. And by the way, this is goal 69.33. It was led by 2.14, which is a refurbished old cab car. Now oh, that looks really? insane. Yep, you heard me correctly. A refurbished old cab car is finally in service. And to be honest with you, I'm not a big fan of the design. I honestly prefer the old shape, the regular headlights, and the old paint scheme. 
These refurbished old cab cars has been new LED lights. Just like the new ones. And I'm also not a big fan of the digitalites as well. Because normally the digitalites will flash left to right and stuff like that. But this one, they flash at the same time. This honestly reminds me of a four-way flashers on a car. But there's one question to be asked. Does V still have the K5LA horns? Well, the answer is sadly no. These still have the K5CALS horns. And let me tell you, this one is really terrible. But as a matter of fact though, this horn reminds me of the old days of Gold Transit. Because back then when Gold Transit had terrible horns, they sound like this. <laughs> This was taken back in 2015, when Gold Transit used to be like this. So yeah, that's what this horn reminds me of. And I also heard the emergency horn because the engineer did a short emergency horn blast. And the emergency horn is really powerful. Anyways, let's get back on track. Pushing at the upper end of the train is MP54 Locomotive 679. And that has 12 passenger cars. And this train came onto the Bailey Line by surprise because this was originally on the Lakeshore Lines. But as with today, 214 and 679 is still working on the Lakeshore Lines. And by the way, this is 214's first full run on the Bailey Line to Barry. But although this is the second trip it went onto the Bailey Line. Before this happened though, it actually went onto the Bailey Line to the Rural Gold Station. And then it turned around and headed back to Union Station. And after that, it came onto the Barry Line again, making a full trip to Barry. And I actually saw 214 being delivered on CNA450 last year. So what a coincidence.
Well, that was really interesting, that's for sure. And I'm glad I was able to hear the emergency horn for a bit. Because they blowed it during that second blast. Even though I'm not a big fan of their, um, rebuilds, I feel like this one is still really cool either way. I'm really glad that the old cab cars are coming back by in the new paint scheme and stuff like that. What do you think of your fifth, John? Yeah, it was pretty good. I was not expecting the emergency horn. Yeah, same here. <laughs> yeah, a little bit here. <laughs> but still, this, yeah, the horn kind of reminded me of the old days when the go trains used to have that. You know, they like, uh, used to sound like that back in 2015 and 16. I remember these days really well, so that really brought me back memories. So yeah, that being said though, I really hope you enjoyed the two interesting catches at the East Grand Baby Go Station. If you enjoyed it, then you know what to do. Please make sure you give this video a really big thumbs up and subscribe for more videos if you have already. And go subscribe to Jack Logan W who was with me with when I filmed 251. And John L57 who is with me right now. We just filmed 214 together, which is really awesome. Hopefully we can see them the day next time when it comes onto the Berry. But really cool how it came onto the Berry line for the first time ever. Off it goes to Berry for the first time since it's rebuilt. So yeah. And I actually saw 214 being delivered on 8450 like last year, which is really cool. So really cool to see that. Anyways, enough of talking. Anyways, I will leave your links in the description when I have a chance for fair channels and stuff. Anyways, until my next Rail Fan video, I will see you guys later. Peace out, folks, and I hope you all have a wonderful evening. Say goodbye, John. Yep. Yeah. And yeah, have a wonderful evening, everyone, and don't forget to like. And subscribe for more. Have a wonderful evening. Bye now.